How's it going everyone? So in this video, I'm gonna tell you guys how to get a wide coach through the door. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate the support, helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999. So a lot of people have issues with this and they have two people usually trying to perform this. I just did this, just me. So if you're by yourself, you have no one to help you, this can be done literally by yourself. You don't need anyone, even though having another person makes this 10 times easier. So I move a lot, you guys. I've moved probably eight times in the last nine years. Um, four were, sorry, three were apartments, six houses. So pretty well I'll sell my house every year or two. Um, I know how to do this. I've had, I have so much experience moving a wide couch through a door. Now I literally just did it at a friend's house. The main thing that you guys need to know through moving a wide couch through the door is that it's usually at its smallest when it's vertical. So literally every single time I am moving these couches, I usually always have to go vertical. So if you're trying to get the couch through the, through the door and you just have it normally like horizontally and it's not vertical, the minute you put a vertical, it's probably very, very easy to get it through the door. Here's the thing. All doors are about three feet. Most of them are about three feet. The thing with couches, most of them are not three feet. So most couches, unless it's like a specially designed couch, can get through the doors, you guys. It's just people don't know how to place them. They don't know how to do the angle. Another thing that I've done, that I've done myself, is you can put blankets down and no one knows about this, but if you put a blanket down, it makes it extremely easy, especially on carpet, to maneuver that couch any direction you need. Now, what some people will do is they'll have the coach vertical, but they'll have people holding on to it. This does work, but in my opinion, it's much easier. Even if you have two people to have one person kind of steady the coach and have the other person kind of moving it with the blanket. So try to use a blanket if you can. It makes moving so much easier. And then once you actually have the coach, it's actually good to do little half turns, if you will, to try to get it through the door. So what I'm here to tell you is if you can't get the couch through the door, it's something that you're usually doing incorrectly because most doors are designed. Again, most doors are usually bigger than the size of the couches, you guys. That's just how doors were made. That's just how couches were made. So again, majority of the time you can get any door or sorry, any couch through the door by having it vertically putting it on a blanket and then just maneuvering it in kind of half circles, kind of half movement kind of turns you guys. So that's the best tip. Again, I got this question directly from a subscriber. I just thought I would make it because I move a lot, you guys, and I thought this could help you guys out. So end of video, thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already.